you know, pray for him. Keep it on, man. His hands on him. Turn it on. He fought through it, you know what I mean? So, so hey, give it up for George for just wanting to do the Lord's work, but he is hurt, so y'all pray for him. Can we pray for him now? Yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. Can we pray for him now? Oh, we gotta wait. Come on, George. Come on, George. All this power up in this room? Come on. Can we? I know we we get ready to get brother Sean up, but can we just let me uh, pray for brother George right now? He says your stomach. Okay. <laughs> All right. Father, in the name of Jesus, Father, we just lift this vessel to you up right now. In the name of Jesus, Father, we decree your, decree your word and healing over him right now. In the name of Jesus, Amen. we come against this attack against his body. We speak to his body right now, and we command it to be whole right now. In the name of Jesus, we command this pain to go. In the name of Jesus, body be made whole. Body be healed. In the name of Jesus, we curse every spirit of infirmity and every infection right now. In the name of Jesus, and Father, we thank you for your healing healing power Absolutely. that is penetrating through his body right now healing lord Amen. bringing healing Amen. and wholeness to his body right Amen. now in the name of Amen. jesus and we decree it right now that he is healed Amen. that he is whole in amen. jesus name we pray jesus. Amen. 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 amen amen hallelujah let's give god some praise for his healing hallelujah Y'all give it up for Brother Sean. Woo! Hey, look, uh, we appreciate you guys. Uh, we're going to pray after Sean uh, do his thing. And uh, here you go. Amen, amen, amen. Hey, yo, first of all, man, I'm going to tell y'all something. From last year to now, man, the places that God has took me and the people that he's put me in front of, man, it's been nothing but his just grace, his mercy, and his favor. Uh, how crumbled I was the beginning of last year and how much he's built me up from then to now. Man, it's just crazy, man. You know, if God want to build you up, he got to tear down that old you, man. It says that you cannot put old patches on new wineskins. You can't do it. I'm grateful to be the man that God's building me up to be. Amen? Amen. I promise y'all. So are we. I promise y'all. We building this ark today, y'all. Let's call him on board, you did? Yes, sir. Let's get it. Yeah. 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 Christ high. Boy, Sean G, man. Come on now. I'm still out here trying to preach man. Everybody got a purpose, yo. Don't ever forget it. The enemy's gonna make you think you don't have one. What you do? Amen. Why didn't the 99 go with him? Let's get it. Come on, y'all. We got to do this together, man. Yeah. I'm trying. Need y'all to do this with me. Come on. Amen. Let's get it. Check it out. Yo. I want to make music that a man can use. Listen to it. Calm down before you blow a fuse. Put the younger generation on their knees and cues. And tell them God love them.
Yeah. How about I wrote this track? It's second day after yeah. I'm home from prison, y'all. I know what time it is, man. I just wanted to do it's something new. Right time, man. And this was what was the on my heart when I wrote it, man. Check it out. The streets. Y'all right know what time, time it is, man. We still trying to reach y'all. Yeah. I'm coming every angle, y'all. Drop. Yeah. I'm just your homie from the ghetto. Trying to take the life worth something, not let it go. Yeah. I'm just your homie from the ghetto. Trying to take the life worth something, not let it go. Yeah. I'm just your homie from the ghetto. Trying to take your life worth something, not let it go. Yeah. I'm just your homie from the ghetto. Trying to take your life worth something, not let it go. It's out of time. You were homeless, but that's the way games, man. Stay tuned. I don't know. Uh, um, we we want to be able to um, get the word out um, as much in advance as possible. Uh, we try to do it on the first Saturday of each month. Sometimes it's not possible uh, with our schedules. So just keep your ears open and uh, you know feed us some suggestions and some places. We don't want to be in the same place because if we continue to do it at a live church then people might think it's all of our church and it's all about us. But it's not all about us. We're trying to put something together so that everybody can take part in and so that everybody can feel a part of what God is doing in the city. So if you don't go to a lot of church, you don't go to wherever, wherever you go at, you can feel included. And, you know, you guys can hit me on the inbox, you know what I'm saying? Give us some suggestions, some places, some venues, 
and uh, we're going to work with it. <laughs> you know, um, I, I love to hear other uh, speakers. I love to hear uh, great artists, different artists. Um, but even more so, we like the atmosphere that comes when we do this gathering. Um, you know, the atmosphere that is all about Jesus. It's not about us performing. It's not about us speaking. It's not about our church being magnified in some glorious place. <laughs> but it's all about Jesus being lifted up and him receiving all glory, honor, and praise. Amen. And so, you know, we're open to suggestions, but we're going to continue to do this. And we're going to continue to try to unite the body of Christ so that we don't be a non-effective church. And uh, the crazy part about it is, you know, I'll be, I'll be a little um, transparent, is that <laughs> I've only spoken to one other church beside any events that we've done, but I have people in the streets and in different communities saying, hey, bro, come back. The hood is looking for y'all guys. We want you guys to come. And so that means more to me than preaching at any church in the city because, you know, he does well on need a physician. And so we want to empower the people to go out and not just be Sunday morning Christians, but be Christians 24-7, 365, because people are dying every day, and we're sitting here having good old church. Amen. You know what I'm saying? We've, we've been created for more than that. We've been created to affect and cause change to this earth, and so that people may see the risen Savior in a capacity and a light that he's never been seen in their lives before. And so, you know... Uh, people, you know, they may say what they want about the documentary. Yeah, it wasn't, uh, <laughs> you know, a million dollar budget behind it. But at the same time, right. the message has gone forth right. and people will hear the gospel. They can hear about the saving power and the transformation power of Jesus Christ in their lives. Amen. So, you know, we, this is all it's about. You know, the methods might change, but the mission is still the same. It's all about people having an encounter with Jesus Christ. And so, you know, if y'all have some suggestions, hit, hit us up. You know.